the move to tag script is a fantastically flexible tool. It enables us to move items to a collection of lists that have a specific tag. So here's a super simple example. I'm going to zoom into my inbox and I want to send these three items to where they belong. So I'm going to make sure my cursor is in this list right here. This is a project I'm developing and now I'm going to activate a move to tag script I set up. TT. Both of these are destination lists that I've tagged with this tag here in the top left corner. I can have them appear in this list simply by tagging them with this tag. I'm going to send my item to my projects list. Hit enter and I'm going to quickly follow. Here's the item I just moved and notice this tag in my list title, hashtag TT. Now let me backtrack to my inbox and make sure my cursor is in the next item I want to move. I activate my move to tag script, TT, and I'm going to select my reference list. This is just to show that the item I moved is nice and snug here where it belongs. And once again, notice my tag in the list title. Now this last item, I'd like to move it to a list that is not yet tagged. All I have to do is navigate to my new destination list and tag it. But I'm actually in luck. I already have a list shortcut set up for the list I want to send this item to. So I'm going to jump there now. And now I'm going to tag this list title, hashtag TT. Then I'm going to backtrack to where I was. And with my cursor in this item, you'll see that when I activate my move to tag script, my new destination list is now included in the selection box. I'll go ahead and hit enter because it's already selected. And off my item goes to its new home. This time I'm not going to jump there. Okay, so now it's time to go through the setup steps. It's a piece of cake. I'll jump to the WFX power pack list. And I'm going to zoom into move to tag. Then my move to tag script. Now WFX. And I'm going to use the built-in shortcut maker, WFS. Okay, so I'm going to duplicate the exact same setup I have just to go through the steps with you. And here I enter my tag, hashtag TT. True, I want to move items to the top of my destination list. True, I want to remove tags from the selections. I want my selection to be sorted alphabetically. And the last thing, my shortcut is going to be TT. So here's a warning telling me that I'm about to duplicate my shortcut. That's okay. Enter and save. Now let me jump to my home screen by activating WFX and hitting enter. Being spoiled for options with all the other move to tools we have in the power pack, I only really need one move to tag script. And just this one script is so darn flexible. So here's a quick tip. If you want to maintain the items on your move to tag selection list, all you do is activate your WFX prompt and search for your tag. Mine is hashtag TT. And then all you do is explode the tags in the lists you no longer want to show up when you activate your script. The really convenient thing about setting up a move to tag script is that instead of setting up more move to scripts, you just tag and untag any outline you want to move stuff to. And with that in mind, we have a similar yet different move to dynamic coming up in the next screencast. It's called move to star. You'll find the link in the description box.